Okay, if I collect two more trophies, you need eight in total, then uh, that starts something. And so that makes it worthwhile to see, I guess, how many trophies a any new machine has. The one to my left has only uh, four, I think. Now the scatter symbol in the middle there, you need three of those for a bonus. And then there's an Indian motorcycle logo, which can show up somewhere. Uh, I don't recall exactly how that works, but let's see what happens here. Okay, almost got it there. I don't know when these trophies show up. Anyway, game. Kind of hard to sort out the symbols from each other. Is that it? Oh, good. Let's see what the bonus is pretty quickly here, I think. All right, 10 super free spins, or 10, 10 free spins with super multiplier, or 10 free spins with roaming wilds. I like wilds. Since it's an anyway game, that helps. Wins are modest, but they're accumulating. So far, everyone's been a winner. That was good. That's another one with a five of a kind motorcycle. All right, one free spin left. <laughs> Here we go. I wonder if that's Route 66. All right. Well, there we go. I played this game from a company called Pervasive Gaming in the Gold Country Casino, which is just uh, down the uh, hill from the Orville Dam. And there was a, a forest fire recently there, and you can still smell some uh, smoke in the casino when I played uh, way back then. And uh, this is a rather interesting uh, kind of uh, game and company. They're based in Oklahoma. They make class two and three uh, slot machines. This one that I played was a class three. Now, I did not get the um, those trophy uh, bonus uh, symbols, and if I had gotten eight of them, <clears throat> I would have gotten a, uh, a wheel spin. And in the wheel spin, if I had gotten the Indian motorcycle logo on the spin, then I would have had a chance uh, through a picking game to actually win a uh, Indian motorcycle. Probably not the one up at the top, 
But uh, nonetheless, that's kind of a unique little uh, feature, which I didn't realize while I was playing. Of course, I wasn't betting high enough to probably give me any kind of a chance. And even if you were betting max, uh, you know, that's a pretty nice prize to get. Uh, so it's probably pretty hard to get. But uh, nonetheless, there it is. Now, one more interesting thing about this game. If you were to go to the company's website, pervasivegaming.com, you'll find uh, an advertisement on their web pages for this particular game. And if you uh, click on the button for the marketing materials, you're going to get to see what the PAR sheet is for this slot machine. It's a kind of an abbreviated PAR sheet. Nonetheless, it's going to give you a little bit of an insight behind uh, how uh, a casino was going to look at this game and how it might set it to various levels of odds. So if you're um, interested in what a par sheet is, and it's kind of an industry insider type of uh, document, you know, go to the website. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe so you won't miss a video. And visit our website to learn more about slots and casinos. If you like this video, please give it a like. And we'll also answer your questions and comments.